Good morning, students. Today we are going to start lesson number two, number system. The objectives of this chapter are decimal number system, binary number system, octal number system, hexadecimal number system, and computer arithmetic. Today we are going to cover page number twenty, and the topics of the page are. basic definitions of number system inventor of zero types of number system base values of different number system and invention of modern number system students in earlier time when there was no means of counting people used to count with fingers and the first method of counting has been argued to be counting on finger but they could not count beyond the 10 numbers and for larger numbers they started counting with stones sticks and bones but these methods were not adequate and had many limitations to overcome these limitations many number system were introduced with the passage of time now the question arises what is number system a number system is a set of values used to represent different quantities such as number of students in a class number of states in a country etc we have four types of number system decimal number system binary number system octal number system and hexadecimal number system students every number system contains particular number of base value and the base value is a total number of digits used in the number system like i have written this number 2342 and its base value is 10 means it can contain up to 10 digits this is the binary value 10101 and its base value is 2 now let's discuss types of number system with their base value decimal number system has 10 base value that is from 0 till 9 binary number system has two base value 0 and 1 octal number system has eight base value 0 till 7 and hexadecimal number system has 16 base value that is from 0 till 9 and alphabet a till f these are the capital alphabet and they contain value 10 till 15 in decimal form who introduced zero aryabhat he was an indian who introduced zero students do you know which is the modern number system that we used in our day to day life that is the decimal number system and who invented it is invented by gottfried leibniz decimal number system it contains 10 digits each number can be used individually or they can be grouped to form a numeric value The value of each digit in a number depends upon the following: the face value of the digit, the base value of the number system, and the position of the digit in the number. Each position represents a specific power of the base. The rightmost digit of a number is called least significant digit, whereas the leftmost digit is called most significant digit. See students let's suppose i am taking a number 547 in 547 the 7 is the least significant digit and 5 is the most significant digit and this equation or a value you can write in this form also you have to start from the right side from the least significant digit 7 4 and then 5 and we are going to talk about decimal number so here the base value of decimal number is 
so here i will use only 10 not any other number because every time we have to take a base value so 10 is a base value and whenever you start with the parts your power will be start from zero because in computer every number or every pixel starts from zero 10 raised to power zero the next value is 10 raised to power one and next is 10 raised to power two we have three digits here so starting from zero we will take three value till two zero one and two and after multiplying it you can write like this also 7 40 and 500 now you will think about how 7 has come here because here we are multiplying with 10 so you know whatever the base value is there let's suppose 10 is a base and its power is 0 you know any number power with 0 is known as 1 let's suppose i have a raised to power 0 so its value will be 1 so here 10 raised to power 0 means 1 7 multiply 1 is equal to 7 and here 10 raised to power 1 so 10 raised to power 1 means 10 will be multiplied by 1 time so 10 raised to power 1 means 10 so 4 multiplied by 10 is equal to 40 and here 10 raised to power 2 it means you will not do multiplication 10 multiplied by 2 you will write the 10 2 times 10 into 10 so its output will be 10 into 10 means 100 so 5 multiplied by 100 is equal to 500 the positional value of each digit increases 10 folds as we move from right to left in this example 5 4 and 7 are the face value and their place values are 100 tens and units the place value depends on the position of the digits in the number so students today we have learned about binary number system and its types so read and learn this page for better understanding thank you